The slip stitch is often used to join stitches together or to move along the top of stitches and not leave like another row of stitches. It just kind of moves your, your stitch to a different spot. So right here, I'm going to show you how to join stitches. So I have a circle that I've worked in a loop and I would like to join this stitch to this one over here using a slip knot. So to do that, I'm going to insert my hook into the stitch that I'd like to join to. And I'm going to catch my yarn and then I'm just going to pull that yarn through that stitch and through the loop on my hook. And that's it. Now I have closed up my circle and I've joined those two stitches. Now, say for example, I have um, a pattern that requires me to slip stitch over to, um, you know, the next stitch over. We'll say we're going to slip stitch over to this stitch, right? So the pattern might say something like slip stitch over to the two chain space or something like that. So how do you do that? Um, so I don't have a two chain space here, so, <laughs> but we're going to slip stitch over to this double crochet over here, okay? So you're going to insert your hook into the next stitch, which would be this guy. You're going to catch your yarn and pull it through that stitch and through the loop on your hook. Oh, now we've moved over to that next stitch. All right, and now this is the one that we want to get to, so we're going to do it again. Insert your hook catch your yarn and pull through that stitch and through the loop. There we go. Now we are in that stitch that we wanted to get to. So that's all. So the slip stitch can move you as far as you want. You can continue on down your whole circle if you want to or whatever you're doing, but your pattern will tell you where you want to slip stitch to. It'll say something like slip stitch to wherever it is and you just do it just like that. That's it. So you can see that slip stitch moves your needle along to the place you want to be, but it doesn't leave a large row. It doesn't leave like another row of stitches like a single crochet would. It just moves it along without leaving much, um, you know, without leaving a big stitch there. All right, so that is it y'all. That is the slip stitch.